Um, and you'll find you know, with the, sort of the action coach system and, and, the, and the individual that you work with you know, will give you in the return really from, you know, not just from the cost that you're paying out, it's going to be the return of your life balance as well as your you know, profitability and put you in a more comfortable position going forward. Yeah, we've been probably stuck in a little bit of a rut over a, a number of years. Um, we have great ideas, but we don't ever know how to implement them properly. Uh, frustrating is more the word. Um, you know, we've got a, a great opportunity. Um, we've all constantly invested in new equipment. We've invested in you know, moving up into bigger premises, um, but the value of the work has, has never been as good as it should be. Uh, well, I generally come in at six in the morning and get home about eight in the evening. Uh, I'll be here seven days a week most of the time. Um, so I have a work-work balance and uh, not much of a home life. So uh, when you've been running a business for this amount of years, you tend to uh, only rely on yourself and you find it quite difficult to actually sort of delegate anything because you always find it quicker, easier and know it's done if you do it yourself. There were some uh, odd uh, things that we just did straight away. You know, some, it's sometimes easier for somebody to, to with a different pair of eyes to see the simple things that just need you know, correcting and uh, just in the way of you know, staff meetings every day, you know, just to keep everybody knowing exactly what they're supposed to do every day, it quickly sort of got the staff into a more routine of what the work was needed on a daily basis. And uh, yeah, so and we've you know, built up quite a, a lot of extra work you know, based on some of the works that we've done. Um, you know, because we still feel as though we work almost like a one-man band in a way. Uh, whereas we're now we've got a, a company of 30 staff, you know, it's, it's far from a one-man band and it needs other people to you know, step up to their positions. And, and that's a lot of the area that sort of Simon's working on, you know, now implemented sort of operations manager, you know, uh, somebody on the financial office manager. So to deal with a lot of the day-to-day -day stuff that I was just taking everything on board and, uh, and generally most people are quite happy to, to pass that on to me. We, uh, last year was our, our best year. Um, so, you know, immediately correcting some simple errors, really, uh, pricing, uh, you know, adjustments, and yeah. so yeah, quite quickly, you know, there was a, a quite a quick change to the, the, the strength of the, the business financially. Um, so our turnover was uh, about 2.5 million. Um, last year we finished at 2.7, but this year we look as though we're going to be about 3.3 million. We, our profitability really has gone up from very little to almost from more zero uh, to I think about 100,000 last year so uh, and we're expecting this year to probably be double that. So recent, just as recently as March was our biggest ever month uh, in, from you know, 15 years of trading um, we I think 313,000 turnover um, and our highest previously was just over 300,000 which was last November. Um, and again we're just trying to recruit more staff now and as we find that more staff come in and they fit in the right areas, um, that will take some of the you know, some of the time off me. 